me again, y'all. I know I said my next tutorial would be on the shield, and I promise I'm going to do that. But I had these sitting right here next to me, so I figured I'd show them. These are the pants that I wore. And you again, and I say this all the time, but using the reference materials, when you look at Ivor's pants, they're pieced together. They're kind of like almost this canvasy type of material. And, you know, they're pieced in part together. So scouring the internet, I managed to find these pants, just really thin summer pants. Again, Comic-Con, hot, sweaty. You want to find as light material as you can because, you know, it's going to be wearing around leather. So it had to be cool elsewhere. Found these pants. And then basically what I did is using the pictures, looked at the pictures to see where the seams were on the pants. And then I didn't cut the pants. And I put so much detail into this and then only a very small part of the pants shows when I wear it. So I'm showing you guys now. But first what I did is I went through with the same cordage that I bought. I bought like three of these that we use so much. And that big old upholstery needle and sewed along each leg. Uh, from all the way down on both sides. Didn't do the inside. That was going to just be a little too uncomfortable for chub rub. You know. And then, once I did that, it was figuring out the details for the cuts or whatever they are um, on the front and back. And I basically made my husband put a pair on. And then I just used my little clips here. My little alligator clip thing to clip where the details were. Because instead of cutting them, I just basically sewed in that spot to make it look like it had been sewn together. And so on the front, you can see there's some there, and then again on the back. And then the other leg is, is similar. It had different a different detail here. And then none on the back of this one. That's just how the pants were on the game. That was just, it wasn't difficult. It was just time consuming. And it took lots and lots of time. And it was kind of a time filler, honestly, when it was too late for me to be working out here in the shop or too cold for me to be working on the shop or too hot outside and I didn't want to come out to the shop. So I just made the excuse of, oh, I'll just work on the pants because I did two pair of them and watch Hot Tuna with my dog because he likes to watch bubby and everybody fishing for tuna so there's the pants they weren't hard to do and i did two pair but they just were time consuming but you know devil's in the details so in the end how much of the pants got seen because with the way that the tuna hung down and then the boot covers and everything came up you saw maybe this much of my pants maybe but i knew the details were there so i guess that's the important part anyway See you later, y'all.